Hello and welcome to another episode of Forming the Dutch Empire. In the last episode, we actually were able to gain two pieces of land. I really didn't realize how difficult this campaign is going to be because we have a lot of strong neighbors. Actually, if you look all around us, it's just strong neighbors. So this will be quite difficult and quite interesting to see. So if you like this video, make sure to a like and subscribe and let's get into it. Okay, so here we are. Is there anything immediate to do? We're not even an elector, so that is money. Wars we can declare. Excommunication war. That's doesn't matter to us Denmark we have someone to claim okay so that doesn't matter either so we should fabricate a claim somewhere someone did ask if we can go to war with insular unfortunately they're astray um, so we don't have actually uh, holy war goals it would be interesting to see if we could expand to maybe get like a colony per se in like Africa um, that would be interesting I don't know how well that would work just because um, they are a different religion so it would be possible to do holy wars and stuff with them but you see uh, I think they're just out of uh, range for us to do a holy war or anything like that can we see we could actually fabricate a claim so maybe um, but I think let's see the strength these guys are actually now both fairly powerful so I don't know if we want to do this but I do like the idea of going after Ireland it will make some ugly border wars but a lot of people in Ireland are not that strong so I think it could be a play good place to actually expand so I think that is actually what we might do is we might try to make a Dutch Ireland so let's go ahead and go after Ulster first because I think they are fairly weak yes so we shall go after Ulster and we will try to get like a kind of a weird colony um, out there what else can we do right now? It's going to be quite difficult to really build stuff up. Let's go ahead and build up in Amsterdam. I'm pretty sure Amsterdam is our capital, which actually is perfect. We, we want it to be our capital. Um, so construct new buildings. We are ill. Do no more than was necessary. Um, and she messed up again. Um, how about we just four tyranny and we'll kill her. We're just going to kill her. Um, we killed our physician because that is the second time she has messed up on um, treating us. So let's just not not do that. Let's not have her be in charge of treating us well. Um, our bishop, let's actually recruit a new physician. I Hopefully someone that won't kill us. Ooh, an alliance. Who are you? Half brother, 161. You're not at war with anyone. So I'm going to accept that, to be honest, just because the more the better. Um, let's go for the more expensive person right now, just because we really do need a good physician. Hopefully they will not kill us this time. Oh, their physician is not even that good. So we are ill. Usually you don't die from being ill, but you know, I want to put it past myself to die. Um, one of my counselors just died, and mm, we'll have this 12 brother-in-law instead. Okay. So we really can't build up too much. Let's go ahead and try to see if we can make ourselves a march. I love when you guys do like suggestions in the comments. Um, when you do like demands. Okay, modify and let's be a march because a march will make our taxes left and will actually give us bonuses for our army. So let's modify vassal contract. Um, your contract is obligation. So we are a march now, which is great. Um, my wife, let's make her slay a wolf. And she fails to slay a wolf. Okay, that stinks. I'm glad to be well again. You lost a trait. Oh, nice. So what actually March does, if we look at that quickly again, I did. So it makes our levies the same um, and our taxes down them. But with that, we also gained some bonus like army gold maintenance and levy size and stuff like that. So pretty much we pay less taxes, but our armies are better. So it's uh it's a bonus for us because we get better armies and we pay less taxes but also us paying less taxes means gives them more taxes whoa we're actually in line for the hre why we don't have any kids i don't know why we're in line are people voting for me i have a vote why do i have a vote total score of candidates someone's actually voting for me i I, I vote score. We're currently fourth right now. I don't understand why anyone would be voting for me. Increase opinion. Who are we increasing the opinion of right now? My wife. We do want to increase the opinion of my wife because we want to make her actually like me because right now she doesn't like me. And for those of you that have ever asked about the koala, the koala this bear's name is Todd. Uh, Todd will be in the videos for now. I am getting a, uh, what's it called, green screen soon. So he will be going away soon as well. Um, to make my wife more suitable to my town's approaching her, I can include compliment. Yes, she is handsome in appearance. Okay, we're not in their leisures, I don't think. Excellent, but I'm pretty sure we could easily um, 
What's it called? Oh wow, 21 Marshall. We only have 17. Never mind. That guy's some good Marshall. We're not even close to that. Um, I am yours and forever, and we become soulmates. Nice. Me and my wife become soulmates, which is great. I didn't even have to do that, except for since she did and I didn't, I didn't get any of the prestige bonuses. Oh my love, never let me out of your sight again. You become soulmate, uh, you gain 10 opinion and, uh, yes, romance scheme. Hopefully we can have some more kids. We are 25 only. Wow, we're only 25? Is this game going slower than it used to be? Because usually I feel like we would be way ahead. Um, by now, maybe we just had a lot of stuff to do in the last episode. The one thing that I should do is we should definitely get, um, what's it called? Siege weapons. Focus on our army per se. How soon are we? Not very soon. It's gonna take a while to really build up, um, to expand. Cause look at this guy. This guy's way more powerful than me. He just has a ton of levies. He needs to actually break apart for us to expand him. But I think if we go after... Um, the good old Irish will be able to expand a decent amount. Um, gray days. Okay, so I'm about to be depressed, which is not good. It's all too much. Dang. Melancholic. Why is this guy so sad and ill all the time? It's not good. This is our first leader, and he's kind of doing a little iffy. I don't know how I feel about that. Okay, Ulster. Ulster's on the list. I wanted to go... Hunting? Not really. I don't know if it's going to get anything for us. We do- I have talked about maybe creating a new faith. But do, 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 do. Create a new Christian faith. That would cost a lot. It also would be very fun. See to be done. He had an unpressed claim for Ulster. Let's go ahead and declare war. My claims. Raise troops. And let's go after Ulster. Uh, we don't want to land on their capital because they'll probably have troops there. Let's go force B2. What's the HRE fighting? A tyranny war. Interesting. Let's look at the independence faction is actually quite powerful. Who's trying to... looks like Italy. Italy usually gets their independence quite fast so it makes sense. Tuscany is already independent. Dang. HRE is not doing good. Yeah, I based on, I've done a t I did I've been working on a time lapse and AI videos um, for the update and I have to say so far what I can tell um, the larger empires really do struggle keeping it together. Um, it's quite interesting. Okay, so we don't have the disembark penalty anymore. We should probably kill them quite easily here. Um, are light footmen actually eat armored footmen? I didn't even know that. That's a cool counter. Okay, we should easily conquer this. They're probably going to cycle charge us because that is what the AI does. And there they go. Um, they... No, the, the Isle of Man is their ally. Okay, so we captured a valuable hostage. Right, if these guys cycle charges, we might not even have to siege. We might just win the war if they just go into us. Yeah, okay, it looks like we might just win the war. That's interesting. I wonder what's on our mind. Pensive my daughter gets. Nice, actually. Let's go. Let's make you a uh, learning focus. Just because I think we'll have a son at some point. So we won't have to have her be the heir. And so be it. Nice. So we have, we're starting our Dutch colony. And the good thing about us being a part of the HRE, we can expand freely into Ireland without anyone declaring war on us because no one's going to want to declare war on the HRE. So pretty much we can conquer stuff for free and not risk losing anything. So that is quite nice actually. So we could probably um, Ulster. Let's do Ulster first. Oh, I got an itchy nose. If you guys ever see me itch my nose, I just have horrible allergies, so I always gotta itch my nose. It's literally just how it goes. Um, we can... Who is this? Who is this? We can... Prince Elliot of the HRE Empire. Um, interesting. We can fight for that piece of land. That might be a war we will do eventually. Um, me and my trusted war will not part the end of this clash of metal. Yes, let's... Let's keep with our sword. We're Expected expert. Probably should have kept fabricating a claim, but now that we're right here, we actually actually maybe it was smart to not do it. Uh, now it's only 13 months because we border that nation, so we kind of have a starting colony. Well, actually, probably this is gonna be funny. We might form the Kingdom of Ireland before we uh, form Frisia, which one I don't really want to do that. Um, that would kind of be what's called bad. Um, so. Maybe we won't do that, but the problem is these guys are just so strong it's gonna be hard to stop them. So hopefully we can. My wife is pregnant, which is good. I like when she's pregnant, raid speed up. Okay, so let's go ahead and start conquering more of the Ireland. We could probably go after Iceland too for the means. You know, you always gotta conquer Iceland. Um, the Byzantines are in 
two Civil Wars already? Yeah, see, this is what's going to happen a lot, is that there's going to be a ton of Civil Wars just going on, and then they're going to struggle. So if you, a lot of you haven't read the patch notes, pretty much what is the patch notes is Civil Wars galore. Like, look at this. The, the HRE might actually lose a piece of land here. And if you see they are fighting... Um, this independence is 10%, 44%. Usually it would be a baseline. So now the factions need not as much to uh, uprise. So it's quite easy. My right hand man dies. And so that gains me 20 stress. That makes sense. Okay, maybe we should build up Amsterdam. What do we want to? Probably Manor Mansions. Just because that 0.7 gold, that is really good. And I'm pretty sure, th is that a unique building? I'm not sure. Let me check the duchy. I don't think so. I know that it is a uniqueish building that can't be built on everything. Part of commanding an army, making sure my soldiers have plenty of food, drinking camp gear for a long way. To this end, I come up with a plan for ensuring my soldiers always have supplies in the field. Arrange a network of merchants, stockpile in my stronghold. Let's do arrange a network of merchants. Stewardship challenge and it's 50-50. Let's do it. 50-50, how do we do? When I find this, when they all have his head, and we messed up. Missing supplies. Well, I just didn't want to spend the gold. That is my bad. Um, oh, we also should probably move our rally point over to this in Holland. My son and heir. Nice son. Nice. Let's name a good, uh, let's do Catholic name, because I can pronounce so Daniel. Yeah, may you go strong and wise. Okay, missed the rally point. I did not see how good my son looks. He is calmly nice, so we might have a good diplomat. Nice. Good traits. Oh, we just got 60 uh, taxes from our um, steward. So let's go ahead and do a manor house. Nice. And then our Amsterdam will have a manor house. We do have some good buildings already there. I think the next one we'll have is pastoral lands. Just because I think that's a good one. Liege lost war. Cool. See it to be done. Um, wait, they lost that war? So did they break apart? Oh, Bohemia already broke apart. Dang. Okay. Interesting. Wow, the HRE is really weak already. I don't know if I want to be independent this early on. I don't I don't think I do. We cannot join this faction. Nope, because it's not a religion or culture. I, I don't think so. And now that you see that that's over, it's only six you need 60% power for independence. This one needs 16%, 54. See, it's very interesting. It's very dynamic. Um I am an only fairly recognized offer. I'll be your marshal. Now that I'm your marshal, what do I get? I get prowess, army, gold, maintenance down, levy size. Dude, this makes me actually fight bufferino. Um, I like that. The county has given rise to the Irish insular targeting. Wait, what? Oh, faction has created. And this is, haha, they just got a faction in insular Irish because of the land I conquered. That's actually quite funny. Who is actually sieging this war down? Uh, I don't like that because I want that land. Um, oh, and they did get that land. Hmm. That's actually going to be a much harder war to uh, to win. So let's go ahead and start fabricating a claim on these guys too. Dang. We have to just keep our eyes peeled if the case these guys... Because these guys got 3,000 troops. We would have to call our ally in. And I don't think our allies are that strong. No. We... It'd be too close. Not not too close. I mean, like, it'd, it'd just be a difficult war. And I don't know if I want to do that type of difficult war. This claim, however, how much... Oh, I lose a lot of prestige. I don't know if I like that. However, you, sir, 2,500 hmm, for 56 prestige only. Let's try it. You know, let's let's take some risks, you know, do do a little bit more. So let's go raise our troops up. Um, we should probably call an ally in a more powerful one. How powerful are you? 777. Um, let's call you in for 700 and however much I said. All our troops are risen up here. Excellent. Um, we actually have all our troops. Let's go ahead and start a battle right there. Okay, we're on four speed. Ooh, they have all their troops there. I wasn't expecting that, to be honest. My bad. I already lost the battle. Well, that's okay, right? And you, uh, so fun. Perfect little daughter. Um, Judith, I can pronounce that too. Wow, we already have a thousand troops. We're already outnumbered. They have 3,000 troops. Did they hire mercenaries? Judith is sickly. They probably hired mercenaries. They always do. Why am I so stupid? Yes, they hired mercenaries. 750. Nice. Nice. I should have, uh, realized that that would happen. 
but unfortunately I did not think that would happen because I didn't think they had that much gold but apparently they had a ton of gold so that was not good declare wars wow I can declare a lot of wars all of a sudden why can I declare war on these guys my claims how did I get a claim on that land or Lorraine someone has a claim okay looks like well I don't know your claims why do I have a claim on this how do I have a claim on that I don't know how I have a claim on it, but I like it. I just got a claim on a whole bunch of stuff. What just happened? Am I like missing something? My claims. I apparently have claims on all this land now too. Okay. Well, maybe we can wipe peace this war actually. Just for the land to get some of the land back home instead. I actually don't know how those claims happen. I'm sure someone will let me know in the comments and I appreciate it. I I thinking someone died and I just was in line or whatever. Um, what do I get for surrendering? How much gold will I have to pay? 268. Hmm. Not a good amount. Not a good amount at all. Well, we're gonna lose this war, unfortunately. Yeah, I think that might be it. We might actually lose it right here. That's not good. Hopefully he will win the battle. I will not, though. So you to be done. Yeah, we can get a claim on that land. That land's actually still pretty good for a claim. Uh, mayor has the right idea. My chimeras can act as they see fit. Yes. Do however you want, guys, but I'm gonna be honest. Um, how dare he? I hope it would not come to buy him with a... I rescind my appointment as marshal. Okay, yeah, we'll just surrender. We lost this war. You know, sometimes... Sometimes we make bad decisions, and this is one of the times. Um, okay, so let's go for this duchy, I guess. I don't know. We got, uh, claims for it, but first... We uh, need to fix our money problem. I'm pretty sure we cannot raid or anything like that. So we're just going to have to pray for our money to come back. Um, yeah, we just are really, really in debt. Um, yeah. Oh, that's not good. Doesn't it guardian for my daughter? Um, I don't really care because I am... Don't need to do it, so we'll have you. But for my son, for whatever he does, I'll probably be in charge of him, just so we can give him good traits. I always thought it was good to try to give him some someone like good. We actually stop increasing the opinion of my wife. She loves me now. Okay, so I say we just five speed it and get our gold back. And then once we get our gold back, um, what's it called? Peasant rebels targeting us. That's gonna probably happen. You're not endured by the church anymore. Well, let's go ahead and fix that because that will give us different taxes. So let's go ahead and do that. We only, we barely give any money away now, which is great because of the march. Whoever commented that, genius. Bossy, ooh, I don't know if I wanted that because that's Marshall and stewardship. Um, I don't really kind of want Marshall. I think because we have to kind of build tall, let's go stewardship. Because I think we're going to have to probably build pretty tall in this game. I think it's going to be hard to to expand too much. Uh, we're trying to make it work as much, much as possible, but we're already having problems. Can't expand there in Ireland, and here we can expand there, but we still are starting to struggle already. Um, what's it called? Um, I would be late to my court to meet her peers. I'm betting everyone includes her. Of of course, yeah, my wife will come. I didn't know that was a thing. Was that in this pack? It's quite interesting. I like that. Um, may you go strong up, perfect little son. Mmm, good Dutch name. So now our, our succession's messy, which I don't like. That's fine, you know. It's okay. I don't mind too much. It's actually, when it's duchy, when there's two of the same, it's not that bad. Not endorsed by bishop. I'll soon tell he will be endorsed. Can't give him any money because we're poor. So, involvement and arms efficiency, that's pretty good. Um, manners is about to be increased. Hey, so now we actually start endorsing chat, uh, church holdings, which we barely have any, so it didn't really change too much. Okay, so actually we don't even have to do any control, we're good. There you go strong, Judith is no longer sickly. Nice. How did my wife die? Died under a mysterious circumstance. Oh, my wife was, my m mother, I mean, was murdered. And my dad died from who knows what. Okay, so my wife is pregnant again. Not my favorite. Rally the troops. Who's declaring war on me? He's going for the county of Frisia. He's going... Oh, he's going for that back. Neat. Let's go three. Let's call our allies in. Well, this is not good because we don't have all our money yet. Excellent. Excellent. Well, we're in debt. 
So that's not good. But he's going to go after Frizia. I think we'll go to four speed. See how well we can hold up. Let's actually raise in Frizia. No, 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 no. That's probably a bad idea. Where do we want to raise? Probably there. Yeah. Um, I kind of don't want to raise because we're in debt by a decent amount. But I think it, we might have to. Really? Where is our ally at? Okay. Youthful Vigor. Yeah, that guy that looks old as dirt has Youthful Vigor. Um, excellent. Where is our other friend? We're really outnumbered, actually. Um, so, nice little break. I say we just start sieging stuff, if that makes sense. I, I really don't, I don't see any other opportunity. Um, is our ally fighting someone over there for us? No, he's slowly coming. Okay, yeah, this is just gonna be... I think we might just lose Frizia. That's, that's kind of stinks. Man, this guy has a whole bunch of allies already. That stinks too. Make us stronger and wiser. Perfect little da daughter. Wilhelmina. Wow, uh, this is not looking good. This has been a bad, bad video so far. Ah, oh, man. We might, we might lose Frizia. I don't know if there's anything for us to really do. They're gonna probably walk through, or they're gonna be confused. Dangerous faction, peasant uprising. Hmm, Ulster and Frisia. Well, Frisia can pop up if they want, but I can't do anything about it. Yeah, I think, oh, we can't afford any mercenaries even if we wanted to, yeah. So, conquered some land. Can we catch up to that army or no? Is our Best hope is to catch up to the army and let's let's catch up to them and then go after their capital. So we're gonna defeat this army here to give us a war score bonus. Um, our, our friend army just doesn't want to help us for some reason, which I don't know why. Um, so we defeated them. That gave us only two percent war points. Which is not very good. We're gonna go capture. Um, we're gonna siege. But let's split in half so we can capture two things at once. Um. Let's see, let's see if we can trick, no, we can't trick our friend's AI. Oh yeah, we'll just keep it here then. I'm gonna say we could try to trick our AI to capture something else as well, because we really don't need 1800 here, but unfortunately our AI is stupid. So I was thinking we could put seven here and get our 600 to go siege here and they're gonna all stick there. And that didn't work. Okay, it was worth a try. Although they did go onto that building instead, which I didn't really care, to be honest. There's any guard for Daniel. Daniel, I will be his ward. Declare wars. Well, we can declare wars now on everyone. But unfortunately, um, a lot of our gold claims that were looking good uh, don't look good no more. Um, geez, oh, this is such, so many good claims there. Um, what is the, do we not have claims on this land anymore? Um... What, what's the nation? Ulsterland? Yeah, they're just super powerful now. Well, well, we'll see. Hopefully, we gotta watch, see if their allies disappear or whatever. Or see if we can interfere. Who's their most powerful ally? They're not that powerful. 1,000. Mm, these are the powerful guys. How is their, um, their Ida through marriage between Oliver Winton and Ida? Who is Ida? Ida, Ida. I don't see Ida. Ida is the old lady. Let's see if we can murder her. We pretty much can't. We're just two. So there's no way we're going to murder, which stinks. Hopefully we can actually siege down this capital here and something happens. But my hopes are not very high. This is should be a rough war to um, win. So the only real hope is if we capture their um, heir or the guy in charge of the army but i don't think that's gonna happen so let's go ahead and go get um can we like walk up we're gonna we're just gonna walk around dude pretend like we're not here um nah just just lose the troops why not it's just gonna be very difficult to win is there a special building here there is hmm we should probably expand to get that there's a lot of special buildings that I just never knew. Never a peasant's lot. Um, I think this should raise troops on Frisia, which is not good. Apprehend them all. Yes, apprehend them all. Mike gain a Marshall perk. We'll try. 
Um, the price of betrayal must be picked. Execute them all. Overworked soldiers for five years. Uh, you will learn from, yeah, you'll learn from scrubbing. That's fine. I think executing them all is a little much. At least the horror of is finally over. Oh, hostage taken. Oh, my son. Oh, no. I was excited. I was like, dang, we took a hostage. And then I realized he took a hostage of my troop. I think we just lose Frizia, to be honest. I really don't see too much working out here. Especially now that they have, um, what's it called? My son. And they just have a lot more troops than I do. So really, I think we just say GG and have a good one. At least we'll kill the peasant rebel right now. Uh, maybe not. I don't know if they'll stack armies here. Oh, we killed the peasant rebel. Enforce demands. And they're gonna stack wipe us here. So I think that should be the end of the war. Yeah, that's pretty much the end of the war. Um, the only thing that we would really like work now is if they go into like a great amount of debt and we get the white piece, but I think they can just piece out right now. They can. Is span. So we lost Frisia. Not nice. Okay. We lost Frisia. These guys have a really powerful alliance, so we can't get that land back. So things aren't going very good. He actually just kind of lost land in this episode. Mm. But we can, however, still click bid it for invading Ireland. I want to learn. Yes, I want to learn. So let's actually, just to end this on a high note, since we kind of lost some land, let's take, well, we, we kind of lost the land we gained. Let's go ahead and uh, take Ireland. See, this is, I like this more than like France and England murdering us. So I'll, I'll take, oh, this is why if we were independent, we'd have the HRE, so the smaller nations killing us and um, England, France, and Denmark. But now only the smaller HRE nations can kill me. So, you know, oh, I guess it's not all bad. Let's go ahead. Okay, we do. Let's go ahead and declare war. They could hire mercenaries, technically. So let's go ahead and ransom. Does not need a guardian for Judith, who is learning focused? Let's do brother-in-law again. There's a lot of wars we can declare, but for some reason, we're kind of equal strength, but I still think they kick their our butt. Um, let's go ahead. Can we hire mercenaries or are we too poor still? We could hire mercenaries, but we'll just put us in debt. So let's go ahead and declare war, see what they do. If they hire mercenaries, we'll hire mercenaries. Um, but hopefully they don't hire mercenaries, but I wouldn't be shocked if they do. It looks like they're not. Watch this, them like time it perfectly, so like they do it right when we throw in. Dang, okay, this is, this is gonna be a hard series. We, we've had some comments that this is gonna be a hard series, but it might really, really might be something. Wow. Even, even the HRE is really struggling already, so that's interesting. I think they're not anywhere to like falling apart, especially because they have an alliance with the Byzantines. But still, this is a, that's a tough war right there. And it's just starting. So let's go ahead. Let's five speed it to try to gain some land. And then we can go ahead and title it uh, Invading Ireland or du Dutch. The Dutch invade Ireland. Yeah. Or we invade Ireland. One of the two. These guys are just going to cycle chargers until we win. Which is quite annoying, but sometimes it actually works for the AI. I, I've seen um, them cycle charge me actually where prepare the ranks, victory. I've learned so much and now I'm a flexible leader. Nice. Okay, enforce demands. Disband. Okay, so we have five out of six territories now since we lost one. We would have six out of six, but we technically expanded a little bit into Ireland, which is quite interesting um we do want to take this land at some point because we have a claim on everything they just have dumb alliances these guys have 1600 upper lorraine has 1000 and now they're allied with denmark too okay who who are they allied with bia billing my cousin can like she just die please okay sorry well, okay, that's going to be it for this episode. Hope you guys still enjoyed. I did make the face cam a little bit smaller because there was a request to do that. Um, but thank you for tuning into this video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe and see you in a new video tomorrow. Bye. See you later. Have a good one.
Here on the screen should be the playlist for this series and the next episode. If you enjoyed this series, make sure to subscribe and then also maybe become a member. If you guys join and become members, you can financially support this channel or maybe support on Patreon. And if we get enough people to do that, I could do this a lot more and much better. Thank you so much. Have a good day.